is t of t of i am calling the timer function from the uh, okay i am not calling this okay you can call from here or you can call the uh, empty block from here from here now you can write if you know the uh, function name you can write from here and it will uh, take so this timer function name is t of i can just write this t of now it will asking for uh, instance single instance data block i will not use this single instance data block i just cancel it and from the data table multiple instance data table i can take it and draw drop it here and set the timer as a 10 second also you have to keep the binary logic here m15.3 as a uh, t of mal t in okay sorry you cannot give the name here you have to rename this term t of multi instance in also you have to declare a output or uh, output or assign a tag here this time we will not the um, give a output here we will assign a tag here let's say it md 100 100 md okay md 1000 no issue you can call it as a t of et yeah. now let's download it this timer will also work now giving a t on it's give output so t of function timer function will work when the in is high it will give a output when the t in goes off means low it will give a output until 10 second here preset time so now t in is high it gives the output if you if you turn off or modify it to zero it will counting the time and it will give output until the 10 second from et et means elapsed time and pt means uh, preset time or load time so you can see the elapsed time from here also also from here okay now i am calling the tnor this is called time accumulated t on r means time on with a reset accumulate time value within a period set by parameter pt so i am calling this timer here asking for single instance i am not using this single instance okay t o n r so i am using this one and give a um, 10 sec 10 second okay uh, 
एम फिफ्टीन पॉइंट थ्री फोर नीनेस टी ओ एन आर टू टी ओ एन आर इन मल्टी इंस्टेंस फॉर मल्टी इंस्टेंस ओके आई एम गिव मी आउटपुट एम फिफ्टीन पॉइंट फाइव एस एन एम एस टी एन ओ आर आउट सो टी ओ एन आर Sorry, I have been aiming my shoes. So, TNR is a also one type of on delay timer, which will accumulate the time that and accumulate time if the input is high. It uh, counting the time if the time is goes uh, if the input low, it will keep the running time. Next time when uh input is high it will counting from that storage time elapsed time uh, after the um, preset time expire that time it will gives a output and this tnr function has a extra feature that it has a uh, reset pin you can reset uh, during the running or you can press the reset uh, after give output you can reset it now download it again how it is work uh, like that on delay time if you keep like this it after 10 second expire it will give a output So it is a on delay timer. If you um, also, uh, it will give output um, until you reset. Uh, if you um, load this input, uh, uh, input output will be kept as a high. So when you reset it, it will be zero. so you have to reset by a import given input name as a t o n r reset t o n r reset okay, now download again so it is still output input is high but giving a output you have to reset it okay now if you give a input here it will counting if you load the input it will stop the timer calculate elapse if you give a again input high it will counting from that storage pin not from the zero okay now if you modify to zero it will store the output below until you reset and until it reset reset okay zero this way you can use that tunnel function also you can use as a uh, running time function also running hour function also okay so there are other tp uh, ic timer also that is called the output ic timer on that one will how it will work Uh, TP 
output type output type the function is same as the block type but it looks uh, different if you call here it will looks like this you cannot give output uh, here like this one uh, you have to call this timer and until you call this timer in other logic it will not work like this timer like this timer like this timer or like this you cannot declare uh, a instruction here output instruction here you have to call this timer in other logic so to check this we will create a tp um, tp output type output type this one also ic timer data type you can uh, this one is a preset time and this one is a timer name so you have to call give a drag and drop ic timer name now you can set the 2 second or uh, 10 second no issue until you uh, drag and drop here or until you uh, reset it will not work so you have to select the time or l time data type or you have to drag and drop first then you can define the time or you can give a variable time also and also you have to you have to call uh, you have to also you have to give a boolean function here that m 15.7 i am giving it here hmm. rename this tp uh, tp out put out put in okay now i am downloading to check you will it counting until this counting is going this timer will not work so it is not counting it will not work that is means it is not working if you give a zero this timer will keep as a high until infinite infinite time until you reset until give a reset so i am now i am using a i am calling this function tp function here give a dot it will give option to use this timer with dot output and now m 16.0 is a ic tp output type out so download again now you can turn on this drag and see it is now working so ic timer output type only work when you dip call this timer in other logic otherwise it will not work it will keep as a idle or if it um, input is high it output um, give a high until you reset it and same way t1 t off and t n o r same way 
you can call it here here and you have to use it somewhere in your logic now I am telling about RT what is RT RT time RT is a reset timer how it is work now I am calling this RT reset timer now see uh, this is a uh, RT timer okay and you have to reset this um, by um, RT time it uh, reset timer means uh, you, you can reset a timer like this one or other timer IC timer by this function and here you have to give a timer name which one you want to reset suppose I want to reset this timer uh, I want to reset this timer so you have to give a here I copy this one and paste this one ok or you can write manually when you want to reset it you can reset by um, by its output pin or you can reset manually by giving a other input I uh, first I am 16.1 I am giving the tag here for manual reset by command uh, RT in so download now this is already okay I am um, low it then high again sorry go for 90 percent okay if I okay, I'll give a um, more than 20 10 seconds to see the effect. So download again. Giving a and so it is counting. If you try to give a output input here so this timer will reset this timer will it is now not counting it is holding see this timer is this timer RT is in it is holding it is not give a output okay it gives a output because here TP is in also reset is in and priority is if tp input is high it will give a output but it is not counting so when your tp is zero it will be output will be zero to false okay so input tp timer is input dominating not reset dominating now i am giving input again in zero so timer is running now if i see timer is true if i give a false so it will reset this you can use the RT timer 
and there is other function is pt this uh, by this uh, pt you can load the time this time you can load the time of this pt okay that's it for today